What's up guys, Clash with Rye Guy here, and today I'm going to bring be bringing you a little tutorial on how to use Discord for Clash of Clans. Um, so I have Discord, I have downloaded Discord from the App Store, it's available on iOS and Android, so we're going to open it up here. Your page won't look like this if you're opening up for the first time. It'll ask you for your account information, if you haven't created one, then there's a little create an account button. But um, we are going to start off, all right, mine's broken right now, hold on. So we're going to open it up again. And all right, so the interface might look a little different for you because I'm on an iPad right now. Some of you might be on cell phones or whatever, but I'm just going to give you the basic rundown of what's going on here. So this little button right here in the top left that has the little three people symbol on it you click on that and that takes you to your friend list and from here you can DM people and search or find a conversation so I'm not, I don't need to do that right now but that's pretty much what that's all about this is your friends I only have two friends I know super sad but online pending blah 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 blocked so that's pretty much just what that is so to this is if you're watching from party land this can work for you too i've set up a discord channel for those of you that are in the cock mafia discord channel um and i'm just going to show you the basics on how to use it so if you're a developer or a co-leader like like me you can click on the little cock mafia thing and it will come up with server settings notification settings change nickname most of you will be able to see all of that except for the server settings I'm not going to go into that but you can change your notification settings to mute blah 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 all that good stuff um, if you want to change your nickname I changed mine to Rye guy the mo fucking legend because I'm a mo fucking legend but you can change it to whatever you want so I've created two channels along with the general channel for cock mafia and this channel I'm gonna use as a welcome channel just to send to this YouTube video so don't worry about this channel try not to speak in it because I want to keep it very empty so we're gonna move on to war match and war match is Warmatch is a website that I have included in our in into Discord. So if we press on the top right here, these two little people, you click on that, you can see who's online and who's offline. This WM bot stands for Warmatch bot, which is is uploaded into this server. So we can activate the bot when you first get into this channel for your first time you're gonna wanna type exclamation point PL space identify and then your hashtag which would be hashtag your hashtag well without the parentheses but you get the idea so if I click hashtag if I do exclamation point PL identity this shows who I identify as in the clan. So the bot will come back and tell me you are Rye Guy the Motherfucking Legend. And this is the village that you are in control of. So I am in control of only one village. You can have multiple villages set up to your Discord account. So if I wanted to take control of another account, I would just do exclamation point PL, identify, and then another hashtag and it should get you in control of another account as well unless that account is claimed by somebody else then we have a problem and I'll figure it out but message me if you need that um, so yeah you're gonna basically log into your account take claim of this account and then from then on out you'll be able to call bases so think of this exclamation point PL think of it as you're talking to the bot you want to tell the bot something so if I if I had said exclamation point PL identify 
my hashtag, I'm telling the bot that I want to identify as Ryguy. As you can see, the hash my hashtag right there. But this this interface is useful for a lot of stuff. So if you ever don't know what a command does, you want to see the list of commands, just type exclamation point PL help, press enter, and then it comes up with a list of commands that you can use to talk to the bot. So I'm just going to go through each and every one of these real quick. PL identify shows what village you control, pretty simple. PL status, this shows how the war is going so far. It'll give you statistics about the war that we're in. Um, you can do it any. You can do it at any point in the war. Doesn't matter if the war is over or not. It'll be able to tell you the status of who's winning in stars, who's gotten more three stars at Town Hall Eleven. Blah blah blah. Um, Kudos. After the war, you can type in exclamation point PL kudos and it gives all the best people from the war. It includes six packs, how many stars people have gained, and it'll track all of that on the on their website, warmatch.us, which is at the bottom. If you ever want to go on there, you can get almost any statistic you want ever. You can find anything on there. Um, exclamation point PL lineup. That just it's it's pretty self-explanatory. Um, PL March, we are not going to be using that. That's too much fucking work. But um, pretty much just gives orders to different town halls that you can have them follow. And you can set it for each war. Um, PL Open 10. So this works for any town hall. You could type in PL exclamation point PL open 11 and it'll show all the town hall 11s that are open so I'm gonna do that here exclamation point PL open town hall 11 you don't have to put the TH but I like to put the TH so these are all the town hall 11s that are open in our current war and it shows how many stars that has on the base um, Currently, we're not using Discord for our wars, so that's why none of them are called or there's no stars on them. But you get the basic idea. So, PL calls. That shows the list of people that have been called on the other team. So, I'm going to explain to you how calls work. So, PL bases, that lists all the bases. Pretty simple stuff. Exclamation point PL call. Eight. Okay, this can get confusing, especially when you're inputting your information from the war. So let's say I want to call number six. I type exclamation point PL call six. See, I'm not in the war, but if you had typed that in, it would have said blah 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 has called enemy number six and then list their name. But so after you if let's let's say somebody doesn't have a Discord app and you want to call a base for them, or they ask you to call the base for them, you can type exclamation point PL. Let's say our number four wants to call there number six and there you go anima called number six but I called it for him so he so he has that base and it's under his account but he didn't have to do it so other people can call bases for you if you can't get on the discord app for some reason um, if you want to cancel your current call or somebody wants to cancel their call and you want to cancel it for them, just do exclamation point PL cancel six. Done. So that base is back open again. And if we had typed PL open town hall 11, number six would be in the list that comes up. Um, okay. So, 
you don't have to do this every single war, but I kind of like to just for kudos to myself. So let's say I let's say I am number four on the war map. I'm going to click PL. I am number four. I attacked number six for a two star 87%. Okay. So the war hasn't started yet, but basically what you're telling the bot is our number four, which in this case, if it was me, I would put my own base. Number four attacked the num their number six for a two star at 87%. And then it'll log that for you. Or if you don't want to do that every single war, at the end of each war, I will automatically log all of the all of the attacks, um, and it does it does that automatically, so I don't have to worry about that. But it's super easy to do, and if you don't want to manually log it, you don't have to. Um, but yeah, that's pretty much it. I mean, it's pretty simple, and if you ever are worried about like what to do or how to do something i'm happy to help you guys out but always go to exclamation point pl help and that is the most help for you and also if you need to message me this is my id and yeah that's pretty much it all right guys thanks for watching i hope this helped you out if you have any com if you have any questions just message me in game or discord or leave a comment in the comment section all right thanks have a good one and clash on